Wow. Wow. Damn, dude. So I'm here for one more day. Uh, the Alpine Loop Fondo was yesterday. I want more, man. I want more. I want gravel. There wasn't enough gravel. So I think we're going to go on the grails and go smash some gravel. Uh, this is kind of just an impromptu video. We're going to see how it goes. And uh, it's been raining all day. It's super late in the day. It's almost 4 o'clock. So <laughs> let's go ride. <laughs> called mass nutton west loop again we're on the we're on the grail so it's the same bike i rode for the raspatutia which it has this like double bar deal i'm just like nervous that he's on a full squish but we're gonna full send dude i'm also on road pedals so if if i need to chalk up as many excuses as i can for how well i do right now i'm on a gravel bike going on a mountain bike trail with road pedals. So, there. Alright dude, let's get right. And like, it just rained all day, so the dirt's perfect, it's overcast. I almost feel like you could not ask for better weather to go for a little dirt ride right now. Tell me about the history of this place. Yeah, so this was uh, bought by the resort, um, but it used to be a bunch of old farms. Some of these old trucks are just abandoned and just got dumped on the side of the hill. There's an old barn down there that we'll ride by. Um, but yeah, it used to be, uh, you know, private property over here. So you'll have all these little fence rows and things like that. But it actually makes for really good riding because there are all these logging cuts and like cool little places. There's... You're going up it or down it? Wow, up it's probably easier than down it. I don't know. The thing is, like, when I switch bikes, I can't really, it's hard to know what I can ride and not ride. So just come out and I guess I just try. Wow, like no big deal. <laughs> Jeremiah just seems like a normal dude, like that no big deal, like, but then you see him do shit like that and you realize why he's a special human. I mean, I'm not trying to like, thank you, to your horn, <laughs> but like if, you know, if you just rolled up to whatever group ride, like, no one's got you marked if you don't know who you are, but shit, dude, you are skilled. Zero chance I'm doing that, bro. Sorry. Wait, I can't clip in. Already lost your wheel. Can you get up it? All right, so I got the challenge to see if I can go up this wall here. Um, <laughs> this is gonna be bad. Okay. Wow. Wow. 
damn, dude. Okay, so what's the secret to like a slippery, very steep climb like that? Like, what are you doing with your body? How are you applying the power to get up that and not uh, not yeah. lose traction? Just be dope. Well, you're kind of feeling the you're kind of feeling what the traction is doing on the rear wheel. So if you're leaning too far forward, you can start to get that feedback of the slipping, and it's like an anti-lock brake. As soon as you start feeling that slipping, you put your weight back. So I'm not like standing out of the saddle like a road rider stands, like real forward. I'm standing and my butt's just back here, just above the seat. But if my butt's on the seat, then I get too much input from the bike or it'll loop out. So it's just that perfect balance spot, that little sweet spot. Um, so that's the key and saving the power for the steepest section. This the first section, I'm just building a little speed and I'm still out of breath. I just, you know, you gotta just nuke it at 800 watts or you will not make it. I have no responsibility for what's about to happen here. Um, is this the last episode of the Vegan Cyclist uh, for this year? It's probably my fault for egging him on. Here we go. That's it, that's it, that's it. Up, 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 up. Oh, so close. <laughs> so that's where, like, you gotta sit further back because I'm yep. spinning. Yep, it just gets to that point and it starts to slip and you're tempted to lean forward, but you gotta... <laughs> That's what really makes the difference, right? Is the... How many cyclists can go 90%? It's the special people, the pros that can do that last little bit. Dang it, dude, I wanted that. This is like Instagram gold right here because like the black gravel road contrasts with the green trees. It's overcast, like it's just, it's just beautiful. The weather's perfect right now. I'm in a t-shirt because you know, Jeremiah's kind of riding circles around us, but it's all good. Freaking amazing, dude. So on the GoPro, you're probably like, okay, that's like a grandma trail. But then you have Jeremiah Bishop on your wheel, so like you can't dab, you can't walk a section. Bro, the last, like that last little section, there was maybe five minutes, I was just white knuckle, like, ah! Oh my goodness. Don't mess up, don't mess up, don't mess up. Okay, so dude, 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 this has got to be one of my, this is, this probably was my top, in my top five favorite rides of all time. It was so much fun. And that, and the reason for that is just because of all things, right? All factors. Like I felt good today. You know, uh, the weather was unbelievably perfect. It's like overcast, the dirt's kind of wet. It's new, right? That's a big thing. It's like new roads are always more fun than old roads. Uh, new bike, like good people, technical, like I did, you know what I mean? I scared myself a little bit. There's a couple times where I'm like, oh my goodness, and, uh, and, and didn't eat shit. So it's like, you know what I mean? There's so many different reasons why this was maybe easily top five, possibly even top three rides that I've done ever. Uh, thank you so much, dude. Yeah. Phenomenal. My pleasure. Bro.
Did I do okay? Oh, super fun. You did great. Why don't you lying? Why? Why you always lying? Why? Oh my God. Stop being lying. You got, you got to loosen up a little bit on the wet roots. It's a little slick out here. The leaves, the roots. This time of year could be a, a bit of a challenge. So you did great. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, you bet. Shots and the GoPro and every like the pictures I got are so good. Awesome. Yeah. Do you Bluetooth it straight to your 